So let's talk kind of globally about hypoglycemia next. So since like the conception of Fresa, what they've consistently shown is that people actually have less hypoglycemia, specifically what we call delayed hypoglycemia, like after like two to four hours after eating. Yep. And that makes sense, right? Because most of the Fresa is out of your system. So you're kind of matching the insulin needs to when the carbs are, are coming better rather than having this dose of Humalog or Novolog hang around for four or five hours and cause lows. That also pertains to exercise. If you're gonna go exercise, you know, like what you wanna do when you go into something that's gonna lower your blood sugar like exercise is you want essentially no insulin on board. If you go for a cycle and you got two units on board, you're probably gonna go low. Um, so a Fresa can help with that because you could take it, you know, a couple hours before you exercise and you can be very confident that that's out of your system by then. Yeah, and I think that's that makes life more convenient. You don't have to wait around. Mm -hmm. You know, nothing worse than a subcutaneous insulin on board before you go exercise. Yeah, and you 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 want to <laughs> the muscles will just suck up the glucose in the blood due to the insulin around, and people will get low. Yeah, so that's very convenient.